lost it by 14, trying to put three more on the board, and Tatum drills a three. And that'll take us to the end of the third quarter. Give it to me, Tatum. I can do this. Hold on. That's what I do. Bucks with two timeouts. Boston just used their last timeout. Here we go. Tatum. Giannis switches on to him. Tatum and Anna Nakupo, the superstar. Step back three on the way. Oh, it banks in. Jason Tatum puts Boston on top with a window three. How about that? Seconds remaining. Turned into a one-on-one -on -one game. The best defender on the Bucks goes up against the best offensive player on Boston. Taking their time, getting the best shot available. His patented move, we've seen Tatum do that. In and out, left dribble, step back to the left angle. And yeah, the bank's open. You can act like you meant to hit that off the glass. In the words of Paul Pierce, I didn't call glass. Atlanta Hawks head coach Lloyd Pierce about some of the nuances of being a first-time head coach as Tatum gets another bucket. With Brad Stevens, primarily with his versatility defensively, but how about that? The defense is lifted, and he puts that pass between the length of Jared Allen and beyond the outstretch chain. Got the switch on to Jeff Green, five on the shot clock. They got to get busy here on offense. Kyrie all over Tatum. Got it off just in time and on time. Wow. Are you kidding me? Actually, in this possession. Then Jeff Green had him, and then Kyrie Irving as the shot clock is dwindling. They weren't making the appropriate switches because they're saying, we don't want you to make the catch. So they force him to catch it in a tough spot and then force that shot. And he still says, how good am I? Tatum off the dribble, kicks it to the corner. Smart will try a three and bury it. Nice play by Jason Tatum and Marcus Smart taking advantage of it. No Oladipo tonight, so he's going to be aggressive. He had 50-something in a game in the Yes, he bubble, did. Didn't he? Jason Tatum catching the ball on that elbow. That's his yeah. sweet spot. A big-time score. Such an easy shot. But there's Tatum going right, step back. Boston back up by six. Oh, oh what a great time. Smart on the run. Throws it out. Tatum, the spin. Up and under for two. Sweet move by that Jason sure Tatum. Tatum leans. Oh, that is slick. That is slick. Detroit's playing hard right now, Mike. Whoa, punched out of bounds by Tatum. Nine with 250 to go. Turnover Pistons. Smart. Oh, nice play. Gives it to the big man who delivers to Jason Tatum. Behind the back to Smart for the long gun, it goes. He looks so thin. He bounced around <clears throat> early in his NBA career here. Souths could use more of that. Three gives him a one-point lead. Smart. That's the Tatum, they Tatum want. takes it. Got it! Remember, no timeouts for Detroit. Good look. Here's the execution. There's the screen, there's the switch. Ty Scott gets out, doesn't set a screen. Look at that matchup. No shot at all for Blake Griffin to guard Jason Tatum on that play. And Boston answers again. Tatum's like, if you're not gonna find me in the half court, I'll just take it all the way up. Think about those two, they're not gonna give up. They're gonna continue to keep fighting. Tatum off the bounce in the paint, throws it up, and yes, it goes in. And he'll have a chance for a three-point play. Add in a guy like Ojale at that four spot. Take a look. You got one-on-one -on -one with Tatum, and he and he has opportunities to just get into his body and go to work. Type of rim presence. Beal loses the handle, smart, kicks it ahead, and Tatum with those nifty sneakers gets an easy two. Tatum wants to go one on one. Step back. That's, that's just money, that shot. Yeah, Tatum, once he gets that side step three, there's nothing you can do about it.